Здесь у меня есть немного амнопона, бутерфанол, трамадол. Сергей Писюник has become a one-man crusader to help suffering patients in his country. At first, he just stockpiled medical equipment in his tiny apartment. But he has gone on to become a modern-day Robin Hood, risking arrest by taking small doses of painkillers from patients who don't need it. Mm -hmm. So this contains seven milligrams, eight milligrams of morphine in it. And delivering it to those who do, all for free. So is this legal, what you're doing? Нет, за это, если нас остановят, посадят в тюрьму. No, if we are stopped, we will be taken to prison. The punishment in Ukraine for illegal narcotics distribution is three to five years in prison. Our tour is one of Sergei's stops. Every few weeks, he brings the old man a supply of painkillers to supplement the small government-approved doses he gets from the nurse. Minutes after the injection, Artur sprung to life. Artur died shortly after our visit. But it was clear that the work Sergei was doing made his last few months Bearable. 